what's up you guys and welcome back to my channel happy new year this is the first haul of the new year and you already know the drill we're doing a jeans haul if you're new to my channel this is actually a series that i started and there are two other videos in this series so i'll make sure that i link those down below and in the cards above so that you can also check those out because those are very helpful and informative. My subscribers love those videos. So don't forget to check those out. And before we get started, if you're not already subscribed, just hit my little initials down in the corner there and subscribe. And let's get into the video. I picked out so many different styles of jeans from H&M. All of them are different colors and different styles just so that we can all get an idea of the fit and whether you need to size up or size down. I'm going to talk you through all the details of every fit that I picked up. For the first outfit that I'm going to actually show you guys, I'm wearing it with this fancy top and I decided to do that to kind of show you guys how you can dress up a pair of jeans for like some drinks or a night out. Wherever you're going, I wanted to kind of show you how these jeans can be dressed up and kick it up a notch. So I paired this gorgeous night out top with some black bootcut jeans that I picked up and I'll get into the details of those jeans in a minute, but first, this top I wanted to talk about. I know you can see the crystals pop in, okay? This is a black silk top and it's lined with these gorgeous crystals and I just decided to button it all the way up to the neck because I thought it looked really cool and I really wanted the collar to stand out. This is actually from Lily Silk and I love the fit of it. It's not too tight on my arms but it's more fitted so you definitely get a nice silhouette of your body and a very feminine shape with kind of a masculine i liked buttoning it all the way up because it gives you kind of that masculine feel with the feminine material and the feminine crystals on it and then i wanted to show you one other top that i also got from lily silk it's definitely more like winter appropriate which is perfect for right now we're still in winter people it's not spring yet it's still cold in a lot of areas in the country so i think that this top is a great basic to layer under coats and jackets with winter wear you definitely need a good turtleneck staple that's going to last you a really long time that's a good beautiful basic color like this one this is the softest most good quality material. It's gonna last you so long because of the materials that were used in it. Lily Silk prides themselves on really good quality materials that are gonna last you a long time. And something that I found really interesting about Lily Silk is that they're environmentally friendly and that their fabric remains go to things like making accessories so they don't waste any of their fabric remains. And the reason that they make such good quality products is because they're creating affordable investment pieces for you to keep in your wardrobe for years. They also have things like silk pillowcases, silk pajamas, robes, and all different colors and sizes. So they definitely have something for everyone. I recommend you guys checking out their website and do a little self-care indulge, okay? In 2022, we're investing in ourselves and our pieces. And I wanted to say thank you so much to Lily Silk for sponsoring today's video and sending me those pieces so that I could show you guys. Now let's get into the details on the bootcut jeans that I'm wearing with this top. So like I said before, these jeans are boot cut. I did get them in the wash black color, but I believe they do come in like a solid, super dark black color, which personally I prefer. They just didn't have it in stock at the time. And also to mention, Everything that I picked up, I tried to keep in mind of things that would be in stock when this video goes up. So everything I picked up was in stock in most colors and sizes to make it easier for you guys when you're shopping. Just wanted to put that out there really quick. These jeans are more of a mid-rise jean and I think that they fit really nicely. I love that there's no tears in it too. I think that gives it a lot more potential to dress up. If you're gonna wear them out on like a night out or some drinks at the bar or something like that and you wanna dress up your jeans, I think a good pair of jeans with no rips is the great way to go. As far as the length on the jeans, I am 5'5", and on me, these jeans are definitely long enough to cover if you were wearing like a boot or something like that. So I'm gonna show you guys how they look with some heels on underneath them. They have some stretch to them. They're not rigid or anything like that. They were true to size. My true to size is usually about an eight and I find with H&M, most things are pretty true to size. So these ones were on point and true to size. Okay, next to go along with the bootleg is a flare jean. And honestly, these ones brought me back to the kind of jeans that I loved wearing in like middle school, I wanna say. They fit so nicely. 
These are a flare high-waisted jean with stretch. They're very fitted down the leg and almost to sort of like the bottom part of your calf and then they flare out. Not too much, not like a bell bottom or anything like that, but a nice flare. I wanna talk about the placement of the pockets on these jeans. I, they got it right, okay? I love the placement of the pockets on these jeans. They're high up on your butt. They're also they're also high-waisted jeans. So in my opinion, that just makes your booty look more perky. The length on them is also great. If you're taller than me, they will still be long enough for you. Also, stayed with my true to size and they do fit true to size. All right, now we're gonna move on to mom style jeans. And I got a couple different mom style jeans. The first one that I'm gonna show you guys are called loose fit mom jeans and they fit true to size. They do have some stretch, but I'm gonna tell you, I am not super thrilled with the fit of these jeans. I just feel like uh, instead of accentuating my shape, they just kind of look a little frumpy. Um, I don't know why. Maybe it's because they're a bit of a looser fit but loose fit doesn't always mean frumpy, so I don't know. I just was not super impressed with the way that these looked on me. I did like the wash of them. They come in many, many different colors as well. High-waisted as well, so, you know, all of those are good things, but again, not my favorite. And I actually got those loose fit mom jeans in two different washes. I don't know if it was because I thought that they were a different style fit or what I was thinking, but I did get them in like a washed black and a blue. Now the next mom jeans though, they're literally just called mom jeans on the website. And you guys, these are a gem, okay? I absolutely freaking love the way that these fit. And let me tell you why. They are a little bit more rigid with some stretch, but the thing that I really liked is I feel like they're loose enough in the right areas and fitted enough to be very flattering on um, a thicker, curvier body. And the best part, the waist is smaller than they were on the loose fit mom style jeans, okay? Which means if you have that waist to hip ratio where you always have that gap in the back, I think you're gonna love these because they it's like they knew what they were doing. They're pretty high-waisted. I feel like they, I think they come above my belly button or right at my belly button. So it's a perfect waist height. And I just feel like they hug me. They fit like a mom jean should fit. They're flattering like a mom jean should be. I like these even better than the Zara mom jeans. I think that the pocket placement is better. I think that the fit is better. Cannot say enough about these. These are the mom jeans that you need. Again, they also come in several different colors and they are true to size. I did get them in my true to size and they fit exactly how you guys will see in the try on clip. So. All right, this category of jeans is more straight leg, including boyfriend style fit. And let me tell you guys, I was so shocked at the style of fit that I fell in love with. So let's get into the details because you need to hear this. Okay, we're gonna start with the boyfriend style fit because <sighs> these are my favorite jeans from the entire haul. And let me tell, when I tell you, I have never found a loose, relaxed fit that I found flattering on my body type. I just, I honestly didn't think that this style of fit was meant for someone that's thicker or, you know, has a booty, you know, just curvy or whatever. Um, I've always felt that they look great on slimmer women and women with slimmer hips and things like that, but these just were cut all the way right in the right places to make them, in my opinion, super flattering for a loose fit jean. I always thought that they would have to be fitted around the top in order for them to be flattering on me, but these ones just changed my entire mind and you need to run out and get them before they're gone because if you're looking for a cool, relaxed, loose fit jean and you love that cool vibe look, but you haven't found any that work for you, these might be the ones. They're not a low rise jean, but they are like right at my belly button, maybe even a little bit lower. And one of the things that I found really flattering about these jeans is a lot of the times with boyfriend style jeans or like loose fit jeans, there's way too much fabric in the zipper area and because I have a short torso, I always find that the zipper area is usually too long. It doesn't ever hit me right in the middle where it should and not have extra fabric or be super baggy in the crotch or something like that. These have the perfect amount of fabric 
to hit me where they need to hit, to not be too baggy in the crotch, and to not get that bunch up that you get when you have too much fabric in that zipper area. I know that was a lot of information to take in, but if you know what I'm talking about, you know, okay? Also, I feel like on the side, in the hip area, they're fitted and then they're looser right where my hips end so you're not getting like a weird super wide fit at the top and then it tapers in and comes out a little bit you're not getting any weird fit like that you're just getting a straight down sort of hugging you but not too much and just falling in the right area i just i don't know if i'm explaining it right but hopefully you get it when you see the try on i also got these in my true to size size 8 and they do fit true to size the next one in this category are called 90s straight jeans and I think that it means like straight leg but I'm not sure if it also means straight like in the hip area. I'm a little disappointed because I really love the shape and like style of these jeans but I think that they run a size small. I definitely would have had to size up at least one size and if I did I can't really say because I haven't tried them in a size up but I do think they would be a great fit if I sized up, but I couldn't even get them over my hips. So other than that, they're not super stretchy, so they're a little bit more rigid, and that might have something to do with why they run small. Okay, last fit category that we're gonna be talking about in the video are skinny jeans, fitted jeans. And the first ones are called skinny high waist jeans. So these ones I would say are just your average basic skinny jean. They come nice and high up on the waist and also the bottoms are pretty long so these are great for if you have long legs. I do actually have long legs um, but if you're taller than me and you love skinny jeans these will probably be great for you. The pocket placement is average. They're not like super high or super close together. They're a great fitting skinny jean for basic everyday wear and they did fit true to size. Like I said I got a size 8 in all of these so they do fit true to my size. These next skinny jeans are also called skinny high waist, but they are definitely a different fit than the last ones that I showed you. However, they do have the same name. So I will definitely link the exact ones so that you guys know the difference between them. Um, these ones were not as long in the leg and they definitely had a little bit more fabric in certain areas. So these are high waisted. They're a different wash. They're like, they're kind of like a, they have a little bit of a beige tone in them. I can tell that they had more room in the hip and booty area so they're not like suffocating you or like super super tight but they are fitted. Um, they're stretchy just like any other skinny jean usually is. They did have a little bit more of like a looser fabric in the knee and if you're anyone like me and you have wide hips you know that if you wear skinny jeans that aren't super fitted in those areas, you can get a weird bunch up in the knee, which I just think does not look nice and is not super flattering. So I'm not impressed with these ones. I would go with the ones before this, before I went with these. Um, also, they hit a little bit higher up on the leg, which I think I said before, but these definitely fit differently. Not my favorite fit. The next skinny jeans are called True To You Ultra High Waist Skinny Jeans and I do like them. I got them in kind of like a gray black wash color. I think for a skinny jean, these ones are great. They're tight and fitted, but not like suffocating. The pockets are on an average placement, not too close, not too wide. Ultra high waist is a little bit of an exaggeration in my opinion. They do come up just above my belly button, which to me, a lot of high-waisted jeans come up right at or right above my belly button, so I guess they could be considered ultra high-waist. But yeah, these are a great everyday skinny jean. I would definitely pick these ones. I also think that they hit nicely on the ankle, but if you're taller than me or if you have longer legs, they might hit at an awkward spot for you. Not really sure. They do have some stretch. They are true to size, so everything's all good there. And for the last pair of jeans in the haul, these ones are gonna be the curvy skinny fit high waist. And in my opinion, these are more of an ultra high waist. They are very flattering. They do have a raw hem on the edge and they are super skinny at the bottom and they come just above my ankle. So they're meant to be a little bit shorter and not like super long over your ankle. I got them in a really pretty dark blue wash, but they do come in other colors. The pocket placement is average, not too close, not too far. I think that these are your traditional 
really flattering fitted skinny jean. They're really flattering on the booty. These are like my typical skinny jeans that I would have been wearing back in like middle school when they were super popular. Um, but yeah, these ones are great for everyday wear. They're great for curvy and they do fit true to size. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and you're enjoying this series. Thank you again to Lily Silk for sponsoring today's video and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.